Hello everyone and welcome to Team Disappoint. This in this episode, get used to you having me yell very loudly because I am very upset. Okay, with Why am I upset, Tim? You are upset because you were accepted into the Dota 2 beta. And I was super excited not oh an hour ago. Right. We would have been making this video sooner, but we had to go get cookie. Yes. Yeah. And so. I am being kind of a cheeky bastard right now, because I just uh, spawned over on uh, the other side of the... <laughs> or I didn't spawn, but I just teleported over to the other side, because we're on an idle server right now. We're on an idle server because my brain hurts so bad, I don't think I can take much more uh, complexity than this, because Dota 2 melted my brain. Oh god, where to begin? Um... I don't want to come off too hard on the game because it is a beta, but Jesus Christ, is it complicated. I thought I'd be like, well, you know, I'm awful at League of Legends, but at least I have an idea of how it works. I dropped into Dota 2 and watched, watched my, I, I died so much, I died so hard, so often. Uh Anything to say, Tim? Um, it looked good. That's really all I got. It was a very pretty game. Um, but it it hurt my brain. It did. True story. Like I was just sitting there the whole time, going, "Oh, make it stop." Hey. And the best part is, it didn't stop. It it just kept going and going. And it just, it, it, it wouldn't stop. I, I begged, I pleaded, but it, it wouldn't, it wouldn't stop, Tim. I, and I know, I was sitting right next to you. I was recording the audio. Hey, we just teamed up and murdered that guy. It makes me feel a little bit better. Yes. But I still feel like I was violated by, my, my, my love and trust of, of, of Valve. It's been put in jeopardy. Like, I don't know what other things that I love could possibly be so violated and harmed. Like, I don't know if I can trust Google anymore now. I mean, Google has my undisputed love and trust, but so did Valve. And, and now, now you, I don't know anymore. You know what's kind of funny about that? We were talking uh, earlier today about how you received the beta, about how... Like, that shit is, like, in your Steam. Like, the second you get that... It is in your Steam. Yeah, it's all up in your shit the second you get that notification, you know? And I was so happy. Like, uh, my first words to Tim were just like, Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I'm in the Steam beta. And I was so happy. Yeah, true story. Like, he was literally calling it a nerdgasm. You know? It's really... And what ended up happening was just leagues of disappointment. Leagues of pain. Which, so much pain. Which, which, uh, I'm actually kind of glad of because we almost ditched League of Fail in favor of doing a Dota feature. But, uh, fear not, the, like, one person that watches us religiously, we are, um, going to continue our League of Fail series. Dota will be a feature eventually, but that's after, um, after, after I stop sucking. Yeah, after he gets a little more familiar with it, you know. Maybe if I get in the beta too, which I doubt's gonna happen, because like I did the survey and it's like, how many times have you played the first Dota? Like, never. <laughs> what characters did you play in the first Dota? Uh, none of them. Roll the dice. Roll the dice. There's no none options. I'm just like roll the dice here. Well, yeah, but that's exactly what I did, and I got in the beta. Yeah. Well, I've never gotten into beta of anything. Oh, I've been in lots of beta, and it never ends well. But yeah, it it clearly is gonna be a good game. I can tell that much. It's just where it is right now. It has no no. <laughs> it's so confusing. Yeah, like there's no direction, is what he's saying. Like there's no. It basically falls under that. The game doesn't explain to you what your goal is or what you're doing. I mean, yeah, it's another RTS, so it basically should be self-explanatory, but in the way it's built, like, in the way it's set up, it doesn't even do that. It's not even like, well, this is an RTS, you know what to do. 
which that's a very sloppy way to do anything with any game, is assuming that the player knows what to do. Now that might be a beta thing, but it's still not something that you want to do. Yeah, so basically, one second. Basically, I we, we deleted all the footage of that yeah, because like, it was just, it was almost unusable because of how just, there was so much going on on the screen which wasn't being explained. Um, there was, there was just stuff everywhere that was, had no adequate explanation as to why, how, what do I do? Obvious that you know you kill the other team and you try and take over their base. That's you know simple, you know easy math. No problem. The problem is how to go about doing that thing. And the even worse part was there was no camera snap with the controls. It seemed like there was, but there really wasn't. That didn't seem to work. And then the whole um, uh, what was it? The the uh, well, actually this was his fault. But we thought that the move didn't automatically bind, but it was actually a passive ability. Like, he didn't realize that, and that's kind of a problem in itself, too. Well, yeah, and the move sounds like a, uh, an active move. It says cleave. Like, you target all characters around you with attacks. Well, yeah, in fact, that meant all of your attacks hit all characters around you, but then why is that a scalable level of ability? Like, shouldn't that just be, like, my attack to do this? Anything else to say about Dota 2, or if you pretty much shot your load on that one? Well, the problem is, it's been about an hour since I played it now. Yeah. So I've lost a lot of my rage, and now I, all I have left is left in sadness and disappointment. Sadness and disappointment. No, but like, everyone, don't let this deter you. It's gonna be a good game. It's just, I'm disappointed that, you know, that uh, that Valve let me down. I, I was expecting an intuitive, fun game, and I got a clusterfuck of a mess. Though I will say, I loved the Courier Goat. <laughs> yeah, so it's probably the most funny had was playing as the. Uh, it was a goat. I thought it was a donkey. It's like a donkey goat lizard robot thing. <laughs> I don't even know, but it was fun. You could make it walk around like five feet, but it was so much fun. Uh, and then someone yelled at me for doing it. Yeah, let's remember that douchebag that was like, "Well, you guys suck. You, if you don't know how to play, you shouldn't play." And it was like everybody else's first time playing. Yeah, everyone was like, "This is the first time I've ever played this game," and he was just like, "Then don't fucking play." And it's like, "Uh, bro, <laughs> it's like there's no established community. This is beta." It, my guess was, he's like, oh, this is like, I, I'll bet you he was the same guy that we saw say, oh, this is like League of Legends, or this is like LOL, because, you know, we know what we think about their community. We love you all, and we hope you watch our videos. Hee 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 hee. You should all go die in all the fires. After oh. watching all of our videos. Thank you. Like, do it, Daring, I don't really care. Yeah, just so long as you get that view number. If you can manage after, that'd be just as good. I'd actually prefer it, because then you won't be able to write in the comments section. No, I want to see. I can only imagine what you're gonna write in the comment section. Oh, 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 you don't know how to play Dota. You suck. And I'd be like, nope, I don't know how to play Dota. Sorry. Yeah, like yeah, the first playthrough of beta. Sorry. Damn. On my fire demo man just cut my head off. So everyone out there in YouTube land, I'm sorry. There's no Dota 2 video. Well, they it weren't even hurt. expecting it, so. Shut up, Tim. I'm sorry, people in YouTube land. I promise I'll make it up to you. Somehow. That came off a little less sexual than I had intended. Well, that was what I was going for. Rather creepy. Uh, so, anything you have to say to the YouTubers? Um... Dota 2 is pretty bad, bro. Like, I still want to play it, I want to try it, because he's incompetent at League of Legends, so I can only imagine if that would transfer over to TF2, or, uh, to uh, Dota 2. So, before we really know if it's that shit, I'd like to try it. 
Dude, you were watching it. Yeah. Did you see a single thing that made fucking sense? I... I did not. I mean, especially the part where the minions were fucking you. Like... Oh, yeah! Oh! They were just taking it away in just insane amounts. Oh. And I was just sitting there dumbfounded, like... How is this even possible? How is this a thing? Yeah. Like... Seriously, now. They're minions. I should be killing them by the swap. They should take some health, but... In general... Fucking minions, yo! I'm a hero! Uh, why does it hurt him? Why, why would Valve bet betray me? I'm sure they did it just to betray you. Clearly. Yeah. You hear anyone else complaining? I actually know I'm kind of alarmed by that. Because that was a bad game, bro. I didn't even know it was possible for Valve to make bad games. I thought that was just, like, not a thing. Yeah. I, I hear you on that. I mean, it was very unusual. Because we're playing a Valve game right now that we both mutually love. Ah! Jim! Shut the bubble! <laughs> Hello, everyone, and have a beautiful night!